The Washington Post is reporting the Turkish government has told U.S. officials it has audio and video evidence that Washington Post columnist Jamal Khashoggi was killed inside the Saudi consulate in Istanbul. Officials say the recordings show a Saudi security team snatching Khashoggi as he walked into the consulate October 2nd, then killing him and dismembering his body. The full audio and video recordings have not yet been released. He had written critically about the Saudi government and the Saudi crown prince, Mohammed bin Salman. The Washington Post has also reported that, based on U.S. intelligence intercepts, Mohammed bin Salman, the crown prince, Prince had directly ordered an operation to lure Khashoggi back to Saudi Arabia. His alleged murder has sparked a diplomatic crisis for the Trump administration, particularly Trump's son-in-law and senior White House adviser Jared Kushner, who's cultivated an extremely close relationship with the Saudi crown prince. In Washington, a growing number of lawmakers are demanding the United States halt weapon sales to Saudi Arabia over the incident. But on Thursday, Trump rejected the idea. I don't like stopping uh, massive amounts of money that's being poured into our country on I, I, I know they're talking about different kinds of sanctions, but they're spending $110 billion on military equipment and on things that create jobs like jobs and others for this country. I don't like the concept of stopping an investment of $110 billion into the United States. Uh, because you know what they're going to do? They're going to take that money and spend it in Russia or China or someplace else. Even before Jamal Khashoggi's suspected death, the Trump administration had been under pressure to halt arms sales to Saudi Arabia over its catastrophic war with Yemen, which has killed thousands of people, pushed millions of Yemenis to the brink of famine, and sparked the world's worst cholera outbreak, with as many as 10,000 new cases of cholera appearing every week. We'll have more on Khashoggi's suspected murder and U.S.-Saudi relations after headlines with California Democratic Congress member Rokhana.